Happy Wednesday, everybody. When Steve and I break our fast, I like to have everything ready to start cooking. If our fast is supposed to end at six at night, I start cooking at six at night. That's my personal choice to do because it pushes me a little beyond my fasting time and it also keeps me from suffering smelling the cooking while I'm not allowed to eat. And you know, a lot of cooking and having good food is tasting as you cook to make sure it's seasoned right. And I, I don't like to do that. So I'm gonna tell you about a website today. I'll put it in the description box below. It's emails.com. They have various menus for various dietary needs, whether it's low carb or budget friendly or heart healthy or vegan or diabetic. And I'll show you all those on the screen in a little bit but it's a great website and they give you two weeks for free in the beginning. Now, once they do charge you, they are going to charge you $5 for each month, but they will charge you for all of the months at the same time. So be prepared for that. It's $60, if I'm doing my math quickly in my head right, $60 for the year. Um, I'm hoping that this will work. If I, I'm hoping to show you how to sign up but then I'm going to log on to my account to show you how it actually works because obviously I don't want two separate accounts. So I'm going to click on this try for free. You get to choose your family size. So let's go with a whole family. There's only three of us in our house. Andrew's moving in October. Um, but there's three of us in our house and your food style. So you get, and later on, as you get further in to choose, you will get to see sample menus. And even if you sign up for keto, let's say that you decide later you wanna do calorie counting, uh, you can switch eight times a day from one menu to the next and they don't charge you for that. So you can change it up however you want. Like we've been vegan before for about two minutes. For about a month um but so i changed from vegan and then i changed back to low carb because that is just simply what works best for us but just know that if you try one that you're not locked into that forever so i'm going to go ahead and go with low carb because that's that's what we do and when i say low carb i mean if it's double digit unless it's a special occasion or we're traveling we don't eat it um i'm just gonna that enter your username and password so here's where it's going to say nope don't need to save it because it's not a real account this is what it tells you what it is so if you get the 12 months you get 50 percent off five dollars a month if you just want to do it for three months it's ten dollars but remember that you get 14 days for free. And it gives you the customer reviews. Let's see what happens if I click here. You're seconds away from solving dinner. I'm trying to see if it tells you about being charged or not charged. After the free trial. So you do get to try it for two weeks and they won't charge your account. So Give it a shot for those 14 days. And if you don't like it, you don't have to do it. They don't charge you until after those two weeks, which is really, really nice. Whenever I have a free trial, I always set a reminder in the calendar on my phone. So if I have 14 free days on day 12, I will set a reminder. Do you wanna keep this or do you not wanna keep this just so I don't get that charge? I'm gonna go ahead and sign on to my account now so that I can show you all what it looks like when you do have the account and how easy it is to switch from one meal plan to another. So right here, I am signed up for the low carb plan for two. Let's say that I decide I wanna to change to, we'll just go with clean eating because that's right here at the top. So I'll click on clean eating. It gives you this little preview down here of menus okay so if I wanted to switch to that I could just click on switch to this plan it asked me to confirm so I'm not going to change anything just because I'm going to go back to low carb to show you all how that works all right so it's just that easy and it comes free with these 
occasion plans and dessert plans. And for a fee, you can add lunch. How much does it cost to add lunch? $40 a year. You can add breakfast for $30 a year. Um, I'm going to check something real quick here, and I should have done it before I got on there. I know for years you could use a promo code of Dave. Yeah, so use the promo code of Dave. I'll put that in the description box below, and it will give you a percentage off. And that's not just on adding breakfast or lunches. So I just do the meals, the dinners. And if I only sign up for the dinners and I use that promo code of Dave, and I think it's for Dave Ramsey, um, you will get a percentage off of that $60 a year. But I'm not going to add that. I'm just going to go back to emails.com. I'm still signed on. I'm going to click on my eel plan, meal plans. I'm going to switch back to my low carb. Yep, I'm going to switch back. And that just proves that they do not charge you to change these. You can, I just changed it twice in five minutes, and there was no fee for that. So, all right. When it loads, you will get two weeks worth of meals. In the beginning, that'll be nice because you'll get this week's and last week's. But once you do it, you know, last week's is one you've already had. So I'm going to click on this week's meal plan and show you how this looks. You will get, most days you will get a main dish and a side dish for every day. And the recipe for the main dish is the one that's here on the top. And then on the bottom is the side dish. And then there's the recipe for each one. They're divided, separated by that line. I like that they show you the um, nutritional information. So like this main dish is four carbs. That's fine. Side dish is 14 carbs. That's high for us. So I will find some alternative for that side dish that day. But you can scroll down and it will even tell you up here, this top one says that it's super easy in the top right hand corner. This is a one dish dinner, which is nice. But you scroll all the way down and there's your grocery list for that day. And it tells you over here, the first column, it will say, you know, this is for meal one. The ingredient in this red onion is used in meal three, meal five, and meal seven. Over here on the right are necessary staples. Those are things that they think you probably have on hand, but they put them on there just in case maybe you ran out of sesame oil or you don't usually carry sesame oil in your kitchen. So that's just something to keep an eye on. I buy my groceries online at our local grocery store. I go online and I uh, put them in the shopping cart and I pick them up. I do that about 80% of the time. Sometimes I just like to get out of the house and I'll go shop. Um, but it's nice because you can just have this list and get online for your grocery store and, and add the things to your cart that you want. And it's really, really nice. Or maybe you use shipped or maybe you have your groceries delivered. Anyway, having that list handy is great for whether you're shopping in the store, whether you order online and pick them up or whether you order online and have them delivered to your house. It's really, really nice. It's really, really easy. I am going to go back to using emails and give it a shot. I haven't for a long time, uh, but I, I think it's just gonna be nice. And I was talking to Krista on Zoom earlier and I tend to break my fast with a pound and a half of asparagus and a salad. And, you know, maybe I like to switch it up a little bit. And I'm also gonna be using recipes from the cookbook uh, the obesity code cookbook. So maybe there will be meals in this list that are higher in carb that I want and I will replace that day's meal with something from the cookbook and I will enjoy that just as well and I really like to cook so I like to try new things. That's going to wrap up this video and I hope you are able to find some recipes on there that you really like and are able to use. I will have all of the information in the description box below. Let me know what you think. Happy Wednesday. Happy fasting.